Hey everyone, if your BMW check engine light won't turn off, and you don't have an OBD2 scanner, don't worry. Today, I'll show you 7 free methods you can try at home to fix and reset the check engine light, no tools needed. Method 1. Tighten the gas cap. A loose or cracked gas cap is one of the most common reasons for a check engine light. Open the fuel door, remove the cap, and twist it back on until it clicks. Then just drive normally. If that was the problem, the light should turn off in a day or two. Method 2. Key cycle reset for older models. Turn the key to the on position, but don't start the engine. Wait 10 seconds, then turn it off. Repeat this process 3 times, then start the engine. This can clear minor ECU glitches, especially on BMW models built before 2010 that use older systems. Method 3. Battery disconnect reset. Turn off the car and disconnect the negative battery terminal using a wrench. Wait 15 to 20 minutes to let the ECU fully reset. Reconnect the battery, start the car, and if it was a minor issue, the light may be gone. Tip. Some newer BMWs may require electronic reset procedures after reconnecting the battery, but this method still works on many models. Method 4. Clean the MOS sensor. A dirty mass air flow sensor can trigger the check engine light. You'll find it near the air intake or air filter box. Carefully remove it, clean it using MOS sensor cleaner, let it dry completely, and reinstall it. Never use water. This helps restore the proper air fuel mix and may turn off the warning. Method 5. Drive cycle reset. Sometimes, the fix is as simple as driving the car. If the issue has already been resolved, the check engine light may reset on its own. Drive gently for about 15 minutes, mixing highway and city driving. If the error doesn't return, the light should go off automatically. Method 6. Throttle reset trick. If your throttle body is out of sync, it could trigger the warning light. Here's a simple reset. Turn the key to on but don't start the engine. Wait 10 seconds, you might hear clicking. Turn the key off and remove it. Wait 60 seconds, then start the car. This can help reset idle control and throttle response. Method 7. Use an OBD2 scanner. If you have an OBD2 scanner, plug it into the diagnostic port under the dashboard. Turn the ignition to on, and let the scanner read the fault codes. If the issue is minor and already fixed, most scanners let you clear the codes, and the check engine light should turn off. This is the fastest and most accurate way to reset the warning. Reminder, this won't fix serious problems. Always confirm the issue is resolved before trying to reset any warnings. Bonus tip, blinking check engine light warning. If your check engine light is blinking, stop driving immediately. This usually means a severe engine misfire that can damage your catalytic converter. Don't just reset the light, get the car checked by a professional. Let me know in the comments which one worked for you. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and share this video with other BMW owners. Thanks for watching, see you next time on the channel.